Hi, happy April. April is one of my favorite months of the year because it is my birthday month. So I'm going to turn 50 later this week and I'm super, super excited about it. And I've got something big and fun planned for you guys too. So watch your inboxes on Thursday or Friday. The big event is going to be Friday. So that's a big thing happening this month. It is also bear month here at Shiny Happy World. So I'm super excited to have lots and lots of bears and bear patterns and a bear crochet along. And the new Ami Club pattern for April is a bear. He's a very special bear. He is a panda bear. So this one was delivered, but it was designed by Alyssa. You guys may remember that she made that awesome Alexander the Frog. So I'm trying to get him, I can never get him in the camera. There you go, you can see his whole body there now. So one of the things that is really, really awesome about this panda is it is super, super easy to make. You guys, basically you crochet all of the parts first and then you crochet him like from start to finish, for start, from, from muzzle to tail and you add in, you crochet in all the pieces. So for those of you who don't like to whip stitch Pieces added on, all of those, all of these are crocheted in as you go. The ears are crocheted in as you go, all of the feet are crocheted in as you go, the tail is crocheted in as you go. The only thing you're gonna have to sew on are these eyes, but um, you can sew them on before you stuff it, and it's just a quick running stitch all around it. So he is super, super easy to make and a really fun and relaxing project. I really enjoyed stitching mine up. I used, I don't know if you can tell this, I used kind of a nubby white fabric, kind of a more like an oatmeal colored fabric, and uh, then like a denim colored fabric that also had a little bit of nubbiness to him. So he's got some great texture to him. And I'll share the details of the yarn. I don't remember exactly what I used, but I'll share the details tomorrow when I post the photograph of my finished bear. So that's coming. That's here now. So you guys can download that pattern right now. If you're in Ami Club, go to your account and you can download the pattern. So what else is coming up this month? I thought I would just take a quick minute to show you some of the things that, um, that, that I'm working on. So one of the things, you can see, if I move, yeah, you can see that little bear in the background. So that is a new bear quilt pattern that's coming. It's gonna be called Bunches of Bears. I've already got a quilt pattern with, called Peekaboo Bears that's one bear over and over and over again. Um, this Bunches of Bears is just a little more fun because all of the bears have different personalities and you get to make 12 different bears instead of the same bear over and over. So I'm also going to play a little bit with the fancy doodads um, like I did with that one. That one has a little party hat on because it's my birthday month. Um, so I'm going to be adding some of the fun uh, fancy doodads to some of the blocks too. If you remember that, Fancy Doodads is the add-on pattern, so it's all kinds of hats and glasses and mustaches and fun accessories that you can add to your quilt blocks. So that's going to be coming, up, I think I'll be finished with it about the middle of the month. I'm not totally obsessed with bears in party hats, animals in party hats in general, but I have done this before and I thought I would show you guys a close-up. This is Benedict Bear. He is one of my favorites. Try and get him so you can see the whole thing. He's one of my favorites of the party animals. See, he's, he's got his little party hat on. It's a little, um, it's got a little daisy, lazy daisy flower stitched on it because he's a very sweet little bear. And you can see I love the stitching in his coat. It just gives it this really nice texture. But he stands nicely. Um, you want to know a little secret. All of my party animals, all of my guys that have stand-up feet, I always make sure to design their feet the right size so that you can drop a couple of pennies down in there before you stuff it. The pennies keep the bottom flat so that the stuffing doesn't round it out at the bottom and make him hard to stand up. And the weight also makes it really easy for him to stand nicely on a table. You can just set him down. He also has a tiny little juice box um, that he can hold because a party is not a party without juice boxes. So that's a previous um, animal with a party hat that I've made. So what else have I got going on this month? I am making some cupcakes, some little felt cupcakes. So this is just one of them. This is actually a Christmas ornament pattern that I've designed that is little felt ornaments. And I just decided it would be really fun to make the cupcakes in a whole bunch of different colors and string them together into a garland. So I'm still working on those, but I'll have them to share hopefully by my birthday later this week. Um, so I've got those guys coming. 
and I'm working on an embroidery pattern. So this one, I, this is just the pattern transferred. You can see it's on that silky, sticky Fabrisalvi that I use to transfer all of my patterns. That's what this the clearish stuff is that's stuck to the fabric. So I'll be stitching that up later this week. And I am working on, this is that improv quilt that I talked about in, on the blog. So all of these were, all of these stripes were stitched together with no measuring, no rulers, um, just really a pair of scissors and, uh, and just sewing them together for fun. So this is just a part of it. Um, this is going to be a placemat, so the other part is wrapped around the frame. But I am almost done with all the hand stitching. So all of this, I'm going to put it super close so you can see. This is all done with big stitch quilting. And it really is like the most fun thing to do in front of the TV. So that is what I've been working on in the evenings. So all of those are things that are coming up this month. So we've got bears and bears and more bears and a little bit of party stuff thrown in and a big, big celebration this Friday. So don't forget to download your Pasha Panda patterns. Those are in your account now if you're in Ami Club and everything else you'll see on Shiny Happy World throughout the month as we go along. Have a great month, everybody. See you, in, see you next month.